Now then YouTube, I'm the Tough Man and welcome back to some League 2 to Premier League, even though I'm probably not going to make Premier League and I'm going to get sacked at the end of this season with Fleetwood Town. Guys, we've uh, we've lost our centre-back for two million quid, an absolute pitiful amount for two million quid there uh, to Southampton. Uh, they've got an absolute bargain for Luis Eduardo there, but I do have a couple of feelers out for some other centre-backs that... Um, that number one, you guys have, have chosen, and number two, that I could poss possibly afford. Now, Matthias Ginter is probably my, you know, my first guy that I would go for. Um, Kurt Zuma, ooh, he's a good... Mm, and, of course, Doria, who's actually more expensive. Kurt Zuma. Guys, I think we're going to go for him, you know. I think we're going to go for him. He's got 20k wage, and uh, might want to try and get him for less. I think we've got time. I think we've got time. I'm going to put four, four and a half mil in for uh, for Kurt Zuma. If we can get him for Kurt, if we can get that for Kurt Zuma, I'll tell you something. That's fucking ledge. That'd be great, guys. That would be fantastic. But let's see if we can. Let's see if we can. Oh no, an hour's gone. We've heard nothing back yet. We're gonna to have to go for it if we hear, hear nothing. Oh, still nothing. Really? Come on, office. What the hell, man? What, what's wrong with you guys? I did put in the bid, didn't I? I'm sure I put in the bid. Kurt Zuma. Right, so what's the problem? I, I don't get it. Why are you taking so long? You shouldn't be like this. Five hours remaining, still nothing. What the hell? I put in a bid, I've heard nothing back. Oh, eventually, one fucking, like, an hour left. Oh, shit. They've accepted it. Thank fuck for that. I'm going to have to pull some real special out of the bag here, guys. Uh, and just go for it. Because this guy... I, I just can't... Right, okay, let me go ahead. Four and a half mil. I'm going to have to, you know, pay through the nose for this guy. Straight off the bat. I can't not have a centre-back, guys. I can't not have one. So we're just going to pay out the, uh, uh, through the nose for this guy. Because why not? We can afford it. We can't afford it. Where are you? Transfer negotiations. Kurt Zuma to the contract offer. <laughs> We're going to pay through the fucking nose for this guy because I can. Crucial first team play. If he doesn't accept that, there is something seriously fucking wrong with this game. 60k. Oh man, that would be immense. He can't, he's got to accept that, surely. It's not thick. Oh, no, come on. Why is it taking hours to make a decision, man? Why? Surely, it should be just going through straight away. Well, if we haven't bought him, it's tough now, isn't it? Way he's accepted it. Thank fuck for that. Holy shit. We've probably paid, paid way too much in the way of wages for this guy, but... We've got a replacement centre-back, and one that'll do a good job as well. There he is, Kurt Zuma, 74 rated. Not bad, actually. Not fucking bad. That's Tonali. Where's the other guy gone? The one that I usually have there. Really? Where's half my fucking players gone, man? Oh, they're all injured, aren't they? Hector Bellerin, Gnabry, Dean Higgins, there he is. Oh, people saying to me, soft man, you're playing people in like the wrong areas. What do you expect when you're playing two centre attacking midfielders in in like central attacking midfield? And it's like, oh, oh shit. Okay, <laughs> calm down, calm fuck down. Dean Higgins there. Yad Nyanazai, Benzia, Marshall, Higgins, Vargas. I'm sure we've got somebody better than that on the right. Oh, he's injured, isn't he? Montoya it is. Naminen. Oh, man. All of our players. It's not a bad side, guys. And we really shouldn't be this far down. But that's what the game is. Totally fucking broken when it comes to away games. Absolutely just broken. So, okay. The office. squad uh, Monthly squad report. Let's have a look. This guy's doing well. 17 years of age. His current overall is between 60 and 72. Hopefully, it's 72. That would be that would be absolutely fantastic. Um, they're all still there. They're all still in with it. So we'll leave them. We'll leave them to it. Uh, transfer deadline day. Player conversations. Sell me in the next transfer window. I'm not being selected. Oh, Matteo Palacci is not happy. 
It's not fucking happy, guys. We're going to have to do the old switcheroo. After I just started out all the team, we're still going to have to do a switcheroo. Scuff it's there. Sprint. Pond. Zuma. Guerrero. Come on, man. Surely. What's his face? Is in a good enough position to play this game. No, maybe not. Ugh. Creswell. Is the meaning like fucked as well? Yeah. He is. Let's put Sprint there then. Guerrero. Uh, Mareko de Guvia, who is a central uh, attacking mid. We want to be a central defensive mid if we can. Ostonal is fucked. He can't play there. We're going to have to use him. Uh, Pacheco on the right. Palacci on the left. Kubo, Ball and Matt. So the, t the two up front are absolutely shit. And, you know, people are saying, you know, you're going to have to get some backup. We're away anyway, so we're going to probably fucking just die miserably. But um, <coughs> you're going to need to get back up for the front two, and that's, you know, that is definitely fair to say. We are going to have to have a look for, for backup guys up, at, uh, up front. 1-0, as you would expect. 80-odd minute as well. You know, it's not as if it's like, oh, it's just annoying. We should not, we do not want to be losing those kind of games, though. We do not want to be losing those kind of games. We're in, uh, we're in February, guys. Um, we're in 18th place. We're out of relegation, and hopefully we can stay there. Um, tournament prize money? Don't know what that was for. Oh, God, that's a bit loud, actually, guys. I'm wondering if you can hear the, uh, the echo. You don't want to hear the echo. Middlesbrough. One. There we are. There we are, guys. Right, let's have a look in the office. Press conference. Don't give a shit. Prize money. 76,500 pounds. <sighs> Up game. Naminen wants to discuss wages. Oh, fucking hell. Been here two minutes. Been here two minutes. And he's like, hey, boss, talk about my fucking wage, you son of a bitch. Because he's getting all the games in the world, you see. So, where is he? I'm sure he's a right back. He is, he's there, look. 500 quid, okay, yeah, he deserves a bit more than that. <laughs> Just a tiny bit more than that, he does. Um, he's going to be like a crucial first team player guy, this guy. Uh, we've got him set at the moment as an important first team player, so let's go ahead and leave him as an important first team player. So. Okay, right, a home game against Bournemouth. Can we actually get a win, guys? It's been a while, and, uh, you know, I've forgotten what it actually feels like to win a game, quite possibly. Uh, Hector Bellerin's back, Zuma, Lascelles, Lascelles, whatever you want to call him, Guerrero. Still, why is Ostwanali not playing? Okay, he should be playing. I know he's pretty shit. I, we're going we're gonna to need another central defensive mid, because I'll tell you something, this guy has not done a fucking good job at all. Vargas, Fukumasuaku, we want Yanazai, Serge, Serge is back, Kubo, Benzia, and of course Marshall. It's not a bad side. It is not a bad side. And people saying about the goalkeeper, I, mean, you know, I think you've got a glitched uh, scuff it. I don't think I've got a glitched scuff it. It's just because he's, uh, he's still young. He's not actually improving because they, they take longer to get to a stage where they do improve or something like that. So, home game, Bournemouth. They've lost two and drawn one of their last three. Get in, Benzia and Marshall. The first win of the episode. Probably the first win of this entire fucking year as well. We're up to 16th place, guys. Nine points behind Leeds United. We just want to keep ourselves nice and safe. We want to, we want to try and end particularly... Uh, if we can end strong, that would be great. Because uh, I don't want to get sacked. And if I get... What the fuck? What's the greatest squad role? Are you fucking joking me? No meaning. Are you actually taking the piss? No, he probably deserves it. <laughs> right back. Naminen. He wants two-year uh, extension. 1,500. Crucial first-team player. He wants all this shit. He wants it. He, he wants to be a part of uh, Fleetwood Town forever. So you can't say fairer than that, man. Okay. Uh, let's have a look. Yeah. Do we swap in? Um... Could do with swapping. I think I'm going to put De Guvia in. No, no, no. Kubo out for Higgins. I think we'll leave it as that, you know. And hopefully we don't get across, you know. It's, it's an away game. We're going to get thrashed anyway. Well, mind you, Birmingham are lower than us. But it still doesn't matter. They've lost all three games. You watch. They'll win this one. Oh, a draw. 20th uh, minute penalty for Marshall. 
So a draw is a draw. They've lost the last three, but pff, I don't know. I don't know, guys. I just never get away games with uh, with this game. It is so badly against you. It's it's mental. Charlton. Wait, Amino. Amino has uh, accepted that. We've got Charlton Athletic coming up. And we've got the end of the season coming up soon as well, guys. Uh, ooh, looking at that. We're looking like we're all nicely fit there. We're looking like we're all nicely fit there. We're gonna gonna get uh, us to an alley in, and uh, of course Kubo. And we're going to get Naminen in. Because we can. Because he deserves to be there, does Naminen. We've got a few out-of-form players. A home game against Charlton, though, should sort that out. Come on now, they are lower than us. Lost a two and drawn one of their last three. Fucking joking, man. Absolute joke. Another 81st minute uh, equaliser. And Charlton... I, <laughs> We shouldn't be losing these matches. We should not be losing. We should be winning those matches with style. Especially against players in, you know, teams in 20th fucking position. We should be, we should be winning those. Brighton and Hove coming up. You want to the squad report. Let's have a look. Oh, his overall's actually dropped. 58 to 68. This guy's overall 46 to 48. It's not fucking brilliant, are they? That guy especially. I don't know, maybe these are... Maybe these are crap. <laughs> this guy here is between 62 and 66 current overall. Uh, who knows how they're going to turn out, guys. I'm sure we'll find out. Palacci. Oh, he's on about it again. Look. Oh, I'm sick of being stuck here. Fucking up bench. Fucking fuck, fuck. Get, go away. Go away, boy. Right, we've got an out of form Naminen. Who has actually gone up in rating? Has he gone up to 71 or is that just me? I'm sure he was 70 a minute ago. Hmm. Interesting. Yanazai is out of form as well. Let's take Yanazai out and put him. Uh, what's his face on? Stop fucking whinging at me, Palacci. Uh, he's out of form, so. Who oh, fuck knows? Fuck knows. I don't care anymore, to be quite. <laughs> I don't fucking care anymore. This game's fucking broken as fuck. Mind you, no, we could do with a better squad. We could do with a better squad. I just hoped that we could improve over this season. And, uh, well, uh, we've got a draw, I suppose, away from home. That's not bad. It's not bad. Press conference. We're getting some results together. 17th place, maybe. But uh, we are getting some results. Look how close it is, though, down there, man. It shouldn't be that close. It should not be that close at all. We've got Huddersfield next. And a home game against Huddersfield. Yanazai wants to be part of the fucking team. I'm going to have to do some sort of uh, switcheroo, maybe. Yeah. County, nil. Like badly do a switcheroo on that one. one. See who it chooses. To Bellerin. Yanazai is there. Benzia is there. It's still not a bad side, uh, apart from the fucking centre back. We're going to have to get another centre back. West Ham United. <sighs> Home game against Huddersfield then. Can we win? They've lost their last three games. So what do those results mean to the hey, Marshall comes off the bench to score. He missed a peno, Jeff. Clark also got sent off and Carroll got an injury for Huddersfield. But we finally put another three points on the board. We've uh, shot up to uh, 16th place. Absolutely shot right up there to 16th place. Mm. Uh, not really shot up anywhere then, have we? So, moving into March. Oh, well into March now. We've got Millwall next. Huddersfield still losing, apparently. Well, they're nearly fucking beat us. They're nearly had us. Players leaving on international duties. We've got an away match to uh, to prepare for now, guys. Against Millwall. Come on. We can save this season. We've got to save. We have to. We've got no fucking choice. Uh, Naminen is going to be playing this game. You know what? This guy... Um, what's his manager's strength? This shit. Middlesbrough, nil. Marking is Nil. utterly crap. Well, this guy does not deserve three. to be. Three. Brighton and Hove Albion. Nil. Where is Wigan he? Three. City. Even Kodriev's better than him, surely. Let's yeah. Take a look at what those results mean to the league table. 
And then, so why is Oztunali that there? There he is. Right, you're in there, Oztunali. Serge Gnabry, Yanazai, Kubo, Marshall, Benzia. Brilliant squad, that. Absolutely fucking brilliant. The goalkeeper's actually letting us down a little bit, and so is the central defensive mid. He is going up. I mean, his his potential should be uh, a lot more than what it, it, it's going up as. It, you know, he's not he's not going up fast enough, is Oztunali. So I, I have no, no idea what's going on there. On goal difference. Go on! An away win! Marshall and Benzia both scoring goals! Holy shit! That's great, that is. That's great. We're catching up to Leeds now, and we, you know, we're getting a, a, a good gap between us and, and, and the relegation zone. If we can just carry on, get a bit more points on the board, try to move up the table a little bit more, then uh, we might actually save our asses here, because I tell you something, we're probably going to get sacked at the end of the se uh, this uh, season, guys. Possibly. It's going to end up getting sacked. Uh, it's, uh, it's on the cards, guys. It's on the cards. Is everybody fit? I think so, apart from Yanazai. Yanazai is not fit. He's going to have to come off um, for what's his first. The other guy. Where is he? Palacci. The one that keeps whinging about not having first team football. Simulate the game. A home game against Derby. They've had a mixed bag of results. 3-0 win against Barnsley, but a 1-0 loss and a 2-1 loss against Bolton. And a 2-0 win, even though they're away from home. And uh, our first team is out, and I can't fucking believe it. I can't believe that our first team just got absolutely smashed there by, by Derby. Um, we were... Oh, fuck off. About my play time. You're not letting me out. You're not letting me out, boss. Disappointed not to start. Well, should be fucking better then, shouldn't you? The first names on the team sheet is in doubt with a player in such a poor run of form. It's disappointing. Team's performance, recent slip in form. Mike, look, we've lost one fucking game, man. We 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 done all right up until that point. So shut the fuck up. Got scout reports. Anybody is going to tickle my balls? Now is the time to tickle them. There is no tickling. He's just going to drop out of that anyway. So there's no point in even looking at him. So nobody tickled my balls from. Uh, from Argentina there. Is anybody going to tickle my balls from uh, the Ivory Coast? I think that's the Ivory Coast. This guy is three months, and uh, I'll tell you something, it looks pretty decent. I'll sign him. Sign him up! 89, 89, 79, 76, and 91. I'll leave it. Cancel. Oh, scouting. Nah, it's probably going to drop out anyway, so we'll just leave it there then. Uh, moving on to uh, Mexico. Anybody going to tickle my balls from Mexico? It looks like not. Nope. Nobody's going to tickle any kind of balls from uh, from Mexico. And we've got Reading next. Not good enough, states Toff. Not good enough. And that's right. I agree with myself. You're thinking of playing Palacci instead of me, boss? Yes, I am, Yanazai. Because you're out of form and you're doing shit. It's probably because I've got him as a left mid rather than a left wing. See, this is a problem, is the uh, the formation that I've got with the players that I've actually bought. Yanazai. No, he is a natural left midfielder. Oh, fuck's sake. I don't know, guys. I just don't know anymore. It's uh, confusing the fuck out of me as this because we really should be doing a lot better than what we currently are. And I've a, a loss is to understand where, why. Let's fucking manage my team. What's going on here? Why Why is... Why, why is... What's going on here? Montoya's fucked. Apparently. Tony Blair. We did better with Tony Blair in the fucking squad. Fuck a Masuaku. Palacci. Let's put him in. Alright, simulate the away game. It's an away game. They've won their last three games. We're going to get just owned by Red in here, guys, I'm pretty sure. 3-0. <sighs> Never saw that coming. <laughs> Never saw that coming. Right, got Blackburn next. English Football League Championship. What's wrong with the cells? I don't know. I haven't fucking got a clue what's wrong with any of them. Alright, I have absolutely no clue... What goes on with any of them? Thanks, boss, he says. Yet he loses as the fucking match. We're going to have to do a switcheroo of, of sorts. No, we are going to have to do a full-on switcheroo. Full-on switcheroo. And uh, for a shit fucking squad. We're going to lose this game. We're going to lose it anyway. Home game against Blackburn. 
They've uh, lo lost, drawn and lost, actually. That's not a bad run up to this, but uh, who knows what can happen, guys. Well, we drew against Blackburn Rovers with the shittest team I could possibly muster, and yet we lost against Derby at home with the strongest one that I could muster. There you go. Rafael Guerrero has now picked up a suspension as well, so our right back is going to be out for this... No, our left back is going to be out for this next game against Blackpool. English Football League Championship. May we discuss wages? We may. We may discuss wages. We may not discuss wages, Steen Higgins, because at the moment, I'm pretty fucking pissed off with you. I'm pretty pissed off with the whole fucking squad. Because you're all a fucking bag of shit. And you shouldn't be a bag of fucking shit. What's wrong with you guys? Seriously. Important first team player. He's not an important first team fucking player anyway. He's nearly better than fucking Kubo. Holy shit, guys. Dean Higgins is fucking legend. It just needs to be better. Just needs to be better. I need to start playing him a bit more, I think. In all honesty. Sasevich. Broghammer. No, 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 no. Let's put Dean Higgins in. Why not? He's out of form. Fuck it. It's fine. It's absolutely fucking fine. We'll leave Benzia there. Latonen's in goal. I've just lost all kind of faith in this fucking squad at the moment because even though we do so well, uh, you know, we do, uh, we've, we've got a really good squad in terms of things. The, the results just, I don't understand the results. I don't know what goes on. I, I, you know, it's all, all well and good saying, oh, you've got to change your formation to this or change your formation to that, but there's just no fucking point at the moment. It's just not working. Nothing seems to work. Um, right, two defensive mids. No, it only leaves me one up front, though. I need two up front, at least. I want, like, four, one, three, two. Oh, that's not bad, actually. Let me go and have a look. Formations. Let's try some out, guys. Four, one, three, two. Ah, oh, the thing is, I want them higher up. Mind you, it'd end up being a 4 1 2 1 2, so there's no fucking point. Um, 4 1 4 1. No. 4 2 2 2 2 2. No. 4 2 3 1 wide. That's better. But I've only got the one guy up front then. We're gonna try it. We're gonna fucking try it out, guys. What's the what? What's the worst that could happen? What we lose? Holy shit! We're doing that anyway. So we, we might as well give this a go. We might as well give this a go. Flood the midfield. And uh, you know we've got two de central uh, defensive midfielders. We've got a right mid in Pacheco, left mid in Maswaku. Uh, attacking midfielder is going to be indeed. Um, where is this son of a bitch? There he is. Higgins. Oh, apparently he's fucked. Oh, hang on a minute. Have we just we've just done a match, haven't we? So Wigan, Wigan Athletic. He's accepted his contract offer. Good. Not that it's going to make any difference because I'm going to be um, I'm going to be sacked at the end of the season anyway. <coughs> I'm pretty I'm pretty confident, guys, that uh, we are possibly going to get sacked. So yeah, just keeping that keep that in mind, guys, for going forward. Sasevich is going to be playing this. I've just got no energy to argue with the fucking guy here. Home game against Wigan. Uh, who knows? Who knows, guys? We've got a shit squad. They might win. <laughs> Pond's injured. I don't fucking get this shit. I, see, I do not get this shit. He's done his leg for fucking two months. It's fine. It's fine. You know what, guys? I think uh, we're in the middle of April. We will end the season in the next episode. Until then, guys, I've been the Tough Man. Thanks very much for watching, and as always, stay safe.